In this Helix Minute, we're going to show you how to assign blocks, rename, and change the colors of the foot switches on a Helix family product. Put Helix into stomp mode by pressing foot switch 6 if you're not already there. If you're using a Helix LT, press the home button to see the performance view. You will see the currently assigned foot switches on the scribble strips on a Helix floor or control, or in the main display on Helix LT. We'll assign the amp block to foot switch 3. Press the amp button on the left of the main display. Briefly touch, but don't press foot switch 3 until the bypass assign dialog appears. Press knob 6 under the main display to OK this change. Pressing foot switch 3 will now toggle the amp block on or off. We can assign multiple blocks to a single foot switch. For this example, we'll assign the optical trim block where the chorus block is assigned. Use the joystick to navigate to the optical trim block, or touch the assigned foot switch. Touch and hold foot switch 9 until the assigned foot switch dialog appears. Then press knob 6 to complete the assignment. You can now activate both the chorus and the optical trim blocks when pressing foot switch 9. We can also have the foot switch toggle between blocks. With the trim block selected, press bypass on the right of the main display. Pressing foot switch 9 now toggles between the blocks. We can also customize this foot switch with a new name and a different LED ring color. Touch and hold foot switch 9 again. Press knob 5 to customize. Press knob 2 to delete any unnecessary characters. We will use the joystick to rename the foot switch to Chorus Trim. Now let's change the color of the ring on foot switch 9 to something else by turning knob 5, labeled Switch LED. Don't forget to save the preset if you want to keep these changes. That's it for this Helix Minute. Please visit line6.com forward slash helix for more product information. Thanks for watching.